Come on, come on. Come on, quick feet, quick feet, quick feet, quick feet. I'm Ben Ashford. I'm the strength conditioning coach, Sanford University. Ha! There! I'm from here in Birmingham and uh, went to undergrad at Auburn. I was a construction manager for six years after I graduated college. So I used to build buildings. Now I build bodies. You need to have weight! Set. But in 08 and 09, when the economy crashed, uh, I got laid off, which was kind of God doing for me what I couldn't do for myself. In 09, uh, I kind of crashed personally and uh, got into recovery from addiction and alcoholism. Get used to holding it so it doesn't roll. Got crazy passionate about exercise. That changed everything in my life. I started to really focus on getting better, both physically, mentally, spiritually, and led me down a journey of uh, my passion is exercise and training the body. My boy Titus! I pour my heart and my soul and my life into these guys. Uh, and that's great and dandy, but they don't come home with me. There you go. Speed, 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 speed. I have very little time uh, to, to date. In other words, if I don't meet her in a gym or up here, I'm not gonna meet anybody. A lot of people in my life have said, you need to get a dog, you need to get a dog, you need to have a dog, you need to have something to love. That's really kind of how I got started is, I don't really have a lot of free time. So I need a companion that goes with me everywhere. Hey. Yes, ma'am. Hi. So this is Sissy. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Come on. Hey, girl. She's my buddy. She, um, she works just as hard as I do. One of my former players, Clay Buckweights, uh, he introduced me to this whole idea of First Foundation and the, the ability to adopt a service dog. So after we went out to the facility and met these dogs, uh, met the trainers, kind of saw what they did, um, then it was trying to you know, create the fit for what dog really calls to you. Sissy was the second one we met and it was instantaneous. Like I've been told, I didn't think was the truth, but when you know, you know. And uh, I knew right away that she would be a perfect fit. Uh, I say, I'll do anything for this ball. You ready? Come on, let's go play. Come on. I know. It's a cold day, though. Sis, sit. Wait. So this is how you know she's actually going to wait. Wait. When she blinks. Yes, sir. Go. Good girl. Girl. You ready? Right. You ready? You ready? Go. <laughs> she's so cool, I'm telling you. I'm the smartest dog in the world. Go. She's not only been a great emotional support for me, she's been an incredible emotional support for a lot of other guys that I didn't predict she could already help. And then I'll go into my office and I see her sitting there in her bed with them big sleepy droopy eyes and I, my voice turns from strength coach. Let's go! Stop talking! So basically this all sweet baby girl uh, kind of love talk and it calms me down real fast. Hey pretty girl. And I'm sure all my players are loving that too because the, the more time I spend with her the softer I get and they, they like that. There you go! Half of them come into my office just to pet her not to talk to me anymore. And I love that. Their faces light up when they, when they talk and play with her. Nice, nice, nice. Good girl. All right, make sure you're popping from your hips, jump and shrug, don't just pull it up. These aren't deadlifts anymore, clean grip. The most rewarding part of what I do is coming in and helping guys um, to deal with themselves, to deal with their lives, their family, their social life, their academic life, their spiritual life. They've changed my life and hopefully I've tried to change theirs. Dog Jacks team ready! Hey. Dog Jacks my team ready! Hey. Dogs exercise!